Hi, I'm Tony Delsdale, one of the co-instructors of the Acts Spiritual Companion Program at Albany School of Theology. If you're anything like me, perhaps you've had what St. Augustine calls a restless heart. That heart that is yearning for God. One of the greatest benefits of the Acts Spiritual Companion Program is the spiritual journey that you'll undertake. It's a spiritual journey wherein you become more aware of God's presence in your life every day, become more aware of how Christ is present in you and in the people around you, and become more aware of the Holy Spirit flowing through all God's creation, drawing all things towards God. And now, let's hear from some of the past, some of the past uh, graduates of the program. I completed the Spiritual Companion Formation Program in 2014. When I signed up for it, I expected only to learn techniques and to acquire a few tools to use while serving as a spiritual companion. However, I actually experienced a carefully designed program of discerning how Jesus very uniquely calls me to be his disciple, not only during the retreat activities, but also to image his holy presence throughout my everyday life. We are serving the Greater New Mexico Acts community by putting on workshops that in emphasize the spiritual formation of spiritual formation of the team formation and making it not a, just a business meeting. We also um, are mentoring other spiritual companions who have not had a chance to go through this program and encouraging them to attend the program. One of the greatest joys we've had is we've both been asked to put on the mini uh, uh, retreat for different uh, uh, teams that are in formation throughout the greater New Mexico area. I guess all in all, we're partnering with God and Church to lead men and women to a deeper relationship with God through the Acts team. Seven years ago, when I enrolled in this training, I was really worried about the time commitment, but truly it worked out just fine. This program has given me the confident trust to practice the ministry, but it's also awakened in me a deep desire to know God through study. I am very grateful for having been in the program and for all of the friendships that I have made from working with other companions all over the country and the teachers and staff at Oblate. I hope if you've been called, you will take a chance, walk through that door, and let God show you what he has in store for you here. We are so excited to be a part of this wonderful program and encourage you to consider participating in the Spiritual Companion Program through the Oblate School of Theology. And we wanted to share with you a few of our own thoughts regarding the beauty of what we learn. First, the tremendous richness and beauty of bringing rituals into the formation process, how to share our spiritual journey with others, how to be good listeners. And we also learned the art of reflecting with our feelings and emotions. Obviously, these skills we are using as spiritual companions on acts retreats within our parish. We're both heavily involved in facilitating study groups within our parish, and these skills are extremely valuable in that process. If you are feeling even the slightest inclination towards the spiritual companion program, or somebody you know is nudging you, take that next step. Trust that the Lord is leading you he will take you on the spiritual adventure of a lifetime. And in the words of St. Catherine of Siena, be who God meant you to be, and you will set the world on fire. So I wanted to give a view of all of our companions who have graduated from the program, who are doing an incredible job in their communities all across the United States. And we encourage you and invite you to consider the call as they have.